This person says he's on the subject of Creflo Dollar. Hmm. <laughs> Amen. All right, what you want to say about the nickel preacher? <laughs> when you call them dollar, that's giving them too much credit. Amen. Come on, sir. The person says, can you guys explain why his teachings are wrong? Certainly I can. Certainly. Mm -hmm. Amen. Give me 2 Corinthians chapter 4, begin at verse 1. Amen. My God, give me a brother Paul, born four. in Tarsus in the city of Cilicia. That's right. Brother Paul said unto the feet of God Milly, who was a doctor of the law, a Pharisee, a believer of the resurrection. Mm -hmm. right. Brother Paul came out the first tribe that offered Israel their king, which was the tribe of Benjamin. Amen. Amen. Now, I tell you why Krefla Odala is a homegrown false prophet. Mm -hmm. I tell you why. Mm -hmm. Second Corinthians chapter 4, beginning verse 1. Listen. Therefore, seeing we have this ministry. Hold it. <laughs> Language of Bible. That's right. That's right. Therefore, seeing we have this, this, this. Ministry. That mean a particular kind. That's right. Notice the apostle didn't say we just have ministry. No, no. We this, have this ministry, meaning there's a, that lets you know there's other ministries. That's right. That's right. But it's not this. That's right. That's right. Because the book says this is that. This is that. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. You understand? That's right. See, the book says this is that. This so is therefore, that. seeing we have this, this ministry. Ministry now. Mm -hmm. Krefler O'Dollar and all you other television evangelistic preachers. Mm -hmm. If you have this ministry, this the ministry. same ministry That's right. That's it. that the apostles have mm -hmm. had, then none of your teaching Amen. will deviate right. the size of a gnat's hair That's right. on his left eyelid. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> That's right. That's how close you are with the book. That's right. None of your teaching will deviate. Amen. Therefore, seeing we have this ministry as we have received mercy, we faint not, but have renounced the hidden things of dishonesty. How are we walking? Not walking in craftiness. Creflo Dollar is a slick preacher. Yes, he is. Crafty. Crafty. That's right. That's why the only messages that these fella have mm -hmm. is faith for money. That's right. Faith and money. That's right. Amen. Prosperity preachers. Amen. Amen. God got a miracle with your name on it. Right. Listen to me, viewer. Therefore, the Lord God of heaven mm -hmm. have never sent no preacher Amen. since the existence of the world. Amen. And just send that man to you to preach how to make money. That's right. Never. God have never sent no preacher to tell nobody no time. God don't want you to be poor. That's right. Jesus said the poor you have with you always. Amen. 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 Listen. Therefore, seeing we have this ministry. As what? As we have received mercy, we faint not. But have done what? But have renounced the hidden things of dishonesty. Not walking in craftiness. Nor handling the word of God deceitfully. Now, when you handle the word of God deceitfully, you handle scripturally, you handle scripture wrong. That's right. That's right. Creflo Dollar, don't believe in the baptism in the name of Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. Not only you, not only that, mm -hmm. there's another dollar. <laughs> That's his assistant. That's right. Amen. Go ahead. Am I right? That's right. That's now, right. If Creflo O'Dollar knew the scripture, mm -hmm. he wouldn't have his wife mm -hmm. as a preacher. That's right. No, he wouldn't. No, he wouldn't. If Dollar knew the scripture, if he knew it. This is what his wife would be doing. That's right. In fact, the scripture advises what the wife should do if she wants scriptural information. That's right. That's ah. right. That's right. All right, son, let's step down in Corinth. Mm -hmm. Come on now. Mm -hmm. Amen. Right. God, the word of God say, if she would learn anything. anything. Let them ask. Even the 14th husband. chapter of the book of 1 Corinthians. First let's Corinthians move chapter fast. 14. Listen. We'll listen. We'll listen. We'll listen. We'll listen. We'll listen. That's right. I want to give you chapter and verse. Amen. That's right. So Dollar can set that book down. That's right. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Listen. First Corinthians chapter 14, we'll begin at verse 33. What is it? For God is not the author of confusion. God. No, 
sir. It's not the originator of confusion. But of peace. But in peace. As in all churches of the as saints. As in all the churches of the saints. Let your women keep silence in the churches. Let your women preach in the churches. Let your women keep silence in the churches. Let your women be the assistant pastor in the churches. Let your women keep silence in the churches. Why? For it is not permitted unto them to speak. Why is his wife on television a Amen. speaker? That's right. And don't go telling me that was for them back there. No, no. The Bible says this, whatsoever things, mm -hmm. whatsoever, whatsoever things, things were written before time. That's right. Were written for our learning. That's right. That we through patience and comfort of the scriptures mm -hmm. might have hope. Amen. You see, you have deviated. That's right. And any time you men deviated from the scriptures, mm -hmm. you cannot be messengers of God. That's right. Listen. Let your women keep silence in the church. Let your women keep silent in the churches. For it is not permitted unto them to speak. Now hold it. Let me break that down and take it apart and peel it off. Amen. So we can dig up the revelation out of there. That's right. Because some fool will say, well, if the Bible says silent, that means silent. They can't. Well, they ain't talking about praying. No, no. Because Hannah prayed. That's right. Is that right? That's right. They didn't talk about singing. Mm -hmm. Because Deborah sung. Amen. It's not talking about prophesying. No. Because Anna was a prophetess. That's right. We get the foretelling of the event that's going to come. That's, that's not preaching. That's right. Given to a woman to prophesy. That's right. To foretell events under the inspiration of Almighty God. Amen. But when you say preach, preaching. that means you are a Bible interpreter. That's right. That means you have a divine inspiration given to you by the Almighty to interpret and break down scriptures. That's right. And God didn't give that to the woman, He gave that to the man. That's right. Listen. Let your women keep so silence. said, hold it. The Bible didn't say he gave it to the man. The Bible plainly states there is a spirit that's right. in man. In man, that's right. And the inspiration of the Almighty, of the Almighty giveth them. Yeah. Them who? The man. The man. Understand. They understand it. That's right. This is not about male chauvinism. Amen. It's about what God said. That's it. Women up preaching. Well, suppose somebody want to be baptized. Mm -hmm. That her body is going through cleansing. Amen. According to the word of God, she's not to be in water. That's right. And according to the word of God, during the time that her flowers is upon her, every place she sit and everything she unclean. touch unclean. is unclean. Unclean. That's right. That's right. Ah! Amen. You get what I'm telling you. Amen. Come on, son. Read on. Let your women keep silence <laughs> in the churches. Yeah. For it is not permitted unto them to speak. But what? But they are commanded. They are just gently request but they are commanded and you lying and women get up saying i know what god told me god ain't told you nothing no he didn't god ain't never told no one nothing that contradict the book that's right if god gonna tell you something that contradict the book why have the book at all that's right just throw the bible in the trash that's right that's right that's right sir. amen when god talk god talk through the scriptures that's right God don't bring a message that contradict the scriptures. That's right. You television preachers, you contradict the book. That's right. That's right. Don't you know the devil preachers use the Bible? Yeah, yes, they do. Oh, yeah. Don't yes, you they remember do. when Jesus That's was right. fasting? That's right. 40 days and 40 nights. He was led up That's right. by the Spirit. Amen. To be tempted mm -hmm. of the devil. Of the devil. The devil talked scripture. Yes, he did. To Jesus. That's right. That's thine feet upon the rocks, for it is written. It is written. The angels will bear thee up. Mm -hmm. Now Satan used scripture with a different agenda. That's right. False prophets use scripture deceitfully. That's right. With an agenda to deceive the simple. That's right. Viewer. These preachers know you don't know the Bible. Mm -hmm. So that's why they read a scripture without divine explanation and interpretation to scriptures. And you go to church waving your hands, <coughs> feeling all nice, that's right. foaming at the mouth, Amen. rolling on the floor like someone sprayed you with a can of rain. That's right. You're like an untamed roach. Amen. Amen. Huh? Amen. Lord of God, we're not going to spray you. We're just going to step on you step on and you. stop you from moving all together. <laughs> That's right. You get what I'm telling you? Let your women keep silence the in the churches. The book says let your women keep silent in the churches. For it is not permitted. It is not. Not It permitted. is not. 
That's right. That goes for Creflo Dollar wife mm -hmm. and any other TV wife preacher that's on television. Not permitted. And that goes for you preachers who wives not on television. That's right. When you do it like the scriptures, no preacher wife is the first lady. Amen. That's right. She got to obey the book like everybody else. That's right. No special privileges. Amen. She's not the queen of the church. No, 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 no. Are you listening to the old man? It is not permitted. It is not permitted speak, unto them to speak, but they, but they are, are commanded, commanded to be under obedience. As also saith what? As also saith the Lord. What about if they want to know something? And if they will learn anything. Where should they do it? Let them ask their husbands at home. Ask their husband where? At home. How did the Apostle Paul feel about women trying to be church speakers? For it is a shame. It it's is what? a shame. Now. Notice the very first statement Brother Paul made, mm -hmm. therefore seeing we have this ministry. This ministry. Right. Now, if you had that ministry, mm -hmm. the same shame he felt, you would feel. That's right. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Glory to God. I said the same shame mm -hmm. that he felt, mm -hmm. but you out there, you don't have no shame. No. That's why some of you men are so timid today and act like faggots. That's because right. Because you sit on the women preachers. That's right. The nature of a woman is to be feminine. Amen. But why is it when you see these women preachers they act so masculine? Yes, they do. Talk like men, sit like men, act like men. That's right. Are you listening to what I'm telling you? It is a shame. It's embarrassing for women to speak in the church. Now we have this ministry. Mm. That's right. This I, ha I have. I'm, I, I'm affected the same way. <laughs> That's right. I'm embarrassed. That's right. It's a shame. It is a shame for women to speak. When a woman speak. try to preach, some of you men. You see, you're so influenced by these television preachers, mm -hmm. you get up there and try to be a preacher, and then you let your wife have her little chair right next to you in the pulpit. That's right. That's now, they, now they take living room furniture and put it in the pulpit. Yes, they do. Have all the comforts of home. That's he right. He robbed from you comfortably. That's right. So, no, that's why, not only that, we have quite a bit of beefs with these oh, yeah. false property, Crefo dollars. Just, right. All right, Dan, next letter. This letter, the email comes from Jamaica. Yes. It says, be careful how you address God's service. Oh. oh Lord. This person says on April the 9th, 2006, Sunday morning at 7 a.m. Yes. I heard you bashing Benny Hinn. Yes, you did. Oh, yes. You heard me talk about Benny Hill. Yeah. I mean, Benny Hinn. <laughs> That's right. Ain't that much different from neither. No, it's not. That's right. Come on, brother. I heard you bashing Benny Hinn from the pulpit, and yes. that is not right. It isn't? Mm -hmm. All right, go ahead, Dan. Let's if you are a real man of God, this person says, you would stop behaving as if it is your church alone that dwells in the Holy Spirit. It is mm -hmm. not my church at all. I don't have no church. No, it's not. It's not the church of Geno Jennings. No, it's not. No, this is the church of the Lord Jesus Christ. That's it's right. not the church of Geno Jennings. Not That's at right. all. That's right. Amen. Come on, brother. Preach to your congregation about how to enhance the kingdom of God, this person says. Well, in order to enhance, you got to know what a false prophet is. That's right. <laughs> Yeah. Must That's right. you, got to, you got to know what a false prophet is. That's right. See, what you want me to do is preach, but ignore false prophets. Ignore them. That's right. Ah, 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 ah. Oh, no. We're not going to do that. No oh, way. No. All right, finish that up, then I'll let you know what Benny Hen, That's right. the hen preacher is. That's, That's right. right. Preach, to your, preach to your congregation how to enhance the kingdom of God, this person yes. says. Yes. And not to set a gap between God's people. He says, I rebuke your folly in the name of Jesus Christ, Hello. our King. I need to know why do you tear down your own brother in Christ? Benny Hinn is not my brother. Not your brother. Benny Hinn is not my brother. That's right. That's Benny right. Hinn is an enemy of the faith. That's right. If you are my brother, that's right. You are happy. Let's get some Bible. In here. Matthew chapter 12 and at verse 30. Now I'm going to build with scripture. Build with it. I want you to follow me, Benny Hinn lover. That's right. I want you to follow me with scripture. That's it. Give chapter and verse. Matthew chapter 12 and we're at verse 30. What is it? He that is not with me. He. He. That is not with me. Is against me. We're not brothers. That's right. Any man can talk to you about Jesus. That's right. The Amen. devil talked to you about Jesus. Amen. Benny Hinn don't believe in no baptism in the name of Jesus Christ. That's right. God ain't never sent a man to go around and blow his breath in your face. Ne no. No way. No, no. Well, what's your problem? Ah. <laughs> That's right. That's right. Notice, you Benny Hinn lovers, the only time you fall down when somebody in back of you to catch you. Amen. Why don't you fall on that solid concrete behind you? That's right. 
That's right. That's right. If you so anoint it, Amen. Amen. Benny Hinn is a joke. That's yes, why when is. you go to his meeting, he pass out through envelopes. $10,000. That's right. $20,000. $50,000. That's He's right. a foreign hustler. That's right. That's right. That came here to America. That's right. To hustle you in Jesus' name. Amen. The name of Jesus is being butchered. Yes, it is. By these false prophets who rape you out of your money. That's right. And they use the name of Jesus as nothing but a cloak. That's it. But because you are biblically uneducated, Amen. spiritually right. ignorant, Amen. don't know nothing about the Bible. That's right. You think because a man comes to you in Jesus' name, he represents God. That's right. That's right. Don't you hear Jesus say, Not everyone that said unto me, Lord, 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 is going to end? That's right. Read the scriptures. Amen. The apostles didn't go around blowing on people. Oh, and the no. book said there's nothing new under the sun. That's, That's right. right. He Amen. that is not with me. Excellent. Don't you hear Jesus say, Who is my mother? That's right. Sister and brother. Mm -hmm. But he that do the will. So, yes. Benny Hinn is my enemy. Yes, he is. Any man that's against one thing that's right. that Jesus said you must do, that's you're right. my enemy. That's Amen. right. That's right. Yeah, Benny Hinn is nothing but another false prophet. He's making millions off of you. His right. offering is ridiculous. What? In the book of Ecclesiasticus. Listen, Chap listen at this. In the book of Ecclesiasticus. I know Ecclesiasticus. many of you are going to get upset. I know many of you is upset right now. Amen. That's right. Glory to God, but it doesn't matter. That's right. Listen at this. In the book of Ecclesiasticus, chapter 34. What is it? And at verse 18. All right. He that sacrifices of a thing wrongfully gotten. He that sacrifice mm -hmm. of a thing wrongfully gotten. His offering. His offering. Is ridiculous. It's ridiculous. The most high is not pleased. The most high is not pleased. With the offerings of the wicked. You folk get up on a stage and somebody blowing on you and you falling down. Mm -hmm. Rolling down, people catching you. They're right. checking on your medical background. That's right. That's right. Ridiculous. Some of you is nothing wrong with you. Amen. But when you come in the door, they dump you in the wheelchair. Uh -huh. Yes, they will. Oh, by the time they're done working on your intelligence, you'll think you don't have none. That's they right. They convince you that you're sick. You got leprosy. You got cancer. You got everything. That's right. You got everything. Says, I heard a speech by Minister Louis Farrakhan. And he stated he was Christ in our midst. He lied. He, lied. he also said he was taken on something yes, called the Yes, you heard medicine. a lie by Minister Louis Farrakhan. Amen. Jesus talked about that false Christ will come. That's right. Right. And he told us that they will say that they are Christ. Amen. So uh, that's, I mean, not only Farrakhan have said it, there are many that have said it. Listen to the book of Scripture. Luke chapter 21 and at verse 8. Pay attention. And he said, take heed that ye be not deceived. No, don't be duped. For many shall come in my name. Many shall come in my name. Saying, I am Christ. Not, that doesn't only mean that people actually come and saying they're actually Christ. Mm -hmm. It don't only mean that, That's but right. it also mean that people come and preach it in the name That's of right. Christ. That's Amen. right. Using Christ's name That's to right. represent Christ. Mm -hmm. They use the name of Jesus Christ in a form of represent or they misrepresent him. That's That's right. They use it as a cloak to manipulate the simple. That's right. Simple, All right. Take heed that you be not deceived, uh -huh. for many shall come in my name, what? saying, I am Christ, and, and the time draweth near. All right. Go don't, ye not therefore after them. Don't, don't do what? Go ye not therefore after don't them. Don't you pursue them. That's right. Go ahead, Dan. This person says, next letter. All right. Well, I'll get you back to the formula. He also said that he was taken on something called the mothership. Yes. What is your understanding of this? My understanding here, and uh, the minister <clears throat> talk about this. Uh, it was said many years ago, I don't know whether it's still said or not, that, he, that the Honorable Elijah Muhammad really is not dead, but he's up on this uh, ship that is called the Mothership. And once in a while, uh, fire cons will be beamed up upon this ship, you know, like Scotty being beamed aboard. Lord. And after he's beamed up upon this ship, he get advice from the Honorable Elijah Muhammad. Uh, and this Mothership is supposed to be the ship, if I'm not mistaken, that's coming back at the end for the universe. Mm. You know, there is no Mothership. No. Elijah Muhammad is dead. That's right. He's in the dust like all of us eventually will get to the dust. That's right. If it be the Lord's will. That's right. So no, there is no mothership. The only one that's coming back for everyone, the Bible says the Lord himself. himself. The Lord himself. That's right. Shall descend from heaven with a shout. That's right. That meaning with a sound. Mm -hmm. With the voice of an archangel. Mm -hmm. And the dead in Christ shall rise. That's right. So this mothership and all this other stuff, no, it's, it's just... Like I often say to news journalist Pierce Morgan, when he questioned mm -hmm. Joel Austin, about homosexuality. Mm -hmm. Pierce Morgan asked him, is it wrong according to the Bible? Yeah. Joel Austin, the cotton candy preacher. Yeah. 
He just said, well, well, I, he knows neither here nor there. That's right. Pierce Morgan said, listen, according to the Bible, mm -hmm. homosexuality is wrong. Do you agree with that? He said, well, I, I, I have friends that are homosexual. Right then he confessed he's of the devil. That's right. Right then. Right then. Amen. Right then. Amen. Because a man that's a real man don't run with homosexuals. No, they don't. No way. A man that's not an alcoholic don't hang with drunks. That's right. A man that's not a racist don't hang with bigots. Amen. That's right. A man of God don't have friends that men lay with men that men speak out against it. That's right.